Hey guys, Tom here, and today we have a FIFA trading tip, but it doesn't actually involve the ability to trade, it just involves being alert, and some of you may know this, and you also may be thinking, why am I on this website? Um, this is just obviously the fixture list for what is on Thursday, so this is Saturday's Christmas list. So what, what basically what this involves is, you can either do two ways, it's obviously, as many of you know, the price of a player in FIFA will be heavily dependent on their real life performances. So I've had a few examples. I bought Suarez and he scored a hat trick. This was quite a while ago. Uh, scored a hat trick and he went up like 30k. And that obviously, if you do that for a lot of players, that makes you an awful lot of money. So what you can do is you can say, look at the first game, Liverpool Cardiff. Obviously, Liverpool are huge favourites to win. So what you can do is you can say, I think we'll go, I don't know, let's have a look, a random player. Who have we got? Goal scorer. So we can say Coutinho. There you go. Because obviously Suarez is going to be a lot anyway. He's probably not even going to go up because he scores so many. But if we say Coutinho, if you want to think Coutinho is going to score a goal or two goals, then you can buy a lot of him now before the game and he will go up. Obviously, that's the risky strategy. You can do that, you will make more money out of it, but obviously it's a higher risk, because if he plays rubbish, then, well, the worst you'll do is you'll lose 5%, because you're selling for about the same price. But the next tactic is you can watch the game live. So if you have the game, you know, if you have the ability, you get the game. I use this website, Flash Score, and it will tell you the game live. And if it pops up, say, Coutinho scores, and you think, hmm, I don't know where to buy him. And then if someone scores again, so if someone in any of the top leagues in Europe scores twice they're going to go up a lot so if you look and you watch the game they're going to go up so make sure you keep an eye on that and then as soon as they score that goal you need to buy as many as you can afford and their price will go up after the game finished you well you can either sell them after the game is finished or when he gets an inform which you should do so that is the that is the way that you can make i've made hundreds of thousands doing it on Suarez, I made some on Diego Costa, and just whoever scores, you know, if they have a good week and they have an inform, players will go up. So that's what you need to do.